Good afternoon guys, it's Kelly from Glamour Girl. So today, um, this was highly requested actually from my boss, Lori Stevens. Hello Lori, hi Anna. Um, they requested that I do my favorite store-bought brands and I thought, you know, that's very true. I mean, I have some high-end brands that I love, but you know, I'm on a budget just like everybody else and I want to kind of talk about what I think are the really, really, you can't really tell the difference, I mean, honestly. So um, I'm gonna start with my face. I have three, four, I have four <laughs> different foundations that I love. Um, I've talked about this before, oops. Um, I've talked about this before, but the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte. I'm in shade 103, okay? Best stuff on the market as far as I'm concerned. I have very oily skin, love it to death. Again, you know, I have a lot of favorite foundations, but this is a really good brand and it's a really good, um, at the price point it is, $11.99, can't beat it. Um, the other one that I love that's my second favorite is uh, Matte Poreless by Fit Me Maybelline. Right here, it says Poreless. And it, it's by Fit Me Maybelline. Love it. It's in the shade 128 for me, but I'm very fair skinned. So, and I don't like to have um, the look of like, oh, I have a bunch of foundation on. This is actually a really good match for my skin. It actually looks like it's my skin. So, I have a very uh, yellowy olive tone. So, okay, then it's kind of, I have like two other favorites. I'm probably going to go with the, the NYX Total Control. This is really good. You can get this. This is a little bit pricier. I think it's like $12.99. It's pretty popular right now. So it's, uh, you know, you, you really just are going to place it on your face and dab it. And then, you know, I use my beauty blender. But um, it is. It's a good, it's a good, I mean, it looks really thin when you, when you pull it out, but it actually really pulls off some really good coverage. So that's my other one. My last one that I really, I just was really kind of shocked about this one because, you know, in my day, Wet n Wild was, <laughs> I don't know how to put it, uh, everything was 99 cents and it was kind of iffy and you're lucky if it even lasted like for an hour. But this one, this is Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. And I'll put that right here, Wet n Wild. And I'm telling you, this has some really, really good coverage. I mean, if you want some coverage, girlfriend, for cheap, right here, Wet n Wild. So those are my four favorites uh, for, for foundations, for sure. Then we go into blushes. So the two brands that I really like are NYX, NYX, if anybody doesn't understand what NYX is. Um, you can get this at any beauty supply store or drugstore. It doesn't, they, they're everywhere. I get it at Target. My favorite blush is called Angel and it's by NYX. It's a really pretty, I don't know, light pink, I guess. That's, that's really pretty. Um, then if I'm feeling a little more, more vivacious, I will try Pinched. That's really, you know, this is honestly a close uh, dupe for uh, NARS Orgasm. So it's, it's weird, it kind of doesn't look like it, but it's really actually pretty good. Like, it's pretty close. And then during the summer, I kind of go a little bit more on the orange side, so I liked this cinnamon color. And I also thought it would be really cool to put on my eyes because I like that color. So that's my, those are my favorites. And then um, NYX, I mean, I'm sorry, ELF. ELF, look at this, four, four of them, ELF. I think it was $10.99 and you get four different colors. And one's kind of a bronzer, so you get so much bang for your buck. It's fantastic. And look at this mirror. I mean, really? Pop that in your purse, you're good to go all day. I'm telling you, this, this was a, a great find. 
Um, the other thing I'll talk about is highlighters. Um, and I really only have one that I would really, well, I guess it's now, it's in the drugstore, so I have two. So I have The Balm, which I've talked about before. I love The Balm. And this has been around for, I don't know, years, years. And then the other one is Elf. <laughs> I don't know which way that's, sorry. <laughs> Elf, I'm telling you, these two rock it, rock it. So definitely wins on that. Um, so contouring, you know, I told you guys about the, the NYX Wonder Stick and they have that at every drugstore you can go to and they don't talk about this on youtube and i'm telling you this is the bomb one side is light and one side is dark i don't really use the light side like i said because it's kind of cakey but i do use the dark you can get this particular one it's a sugar queen wonder stick for i think it's 8.99 on amazon but Again, it's the same thing as NYX. I just was being a little cheaper and got an off name brand and it really works pretty much the same. Um, the other thing that's kind of fun um, that's uh, store-bought is my True Match. And sometimes I'll put this as a, in the summer when I'm tan, you know, I'll usually get some color. I don't really hang out in the sun and I don't think it's a really good idea to do that but we all have to have a little sun. So I will do this um, as a highlighter, you know, like a contour. And then, you know, I've got a little bit tanner skin, I've got a little bit tanner foundation on, and then I use this as a good um, bronzer. So it's kind of fun. So let's talk about eyes an eyeshadow okay so if you're gonna go out and buy any eyeshadow there's two brands that I would really 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 recommend that you can't go wrong with and you know it's colors are always you know everybody's different everybody you know I like fun colors I like golds I like pinks I like greens I like browns I like nudes you know I'm not the biggest blue wear but you know I think with the right outfit and the right environment, definitely. Um, so I always go for Color Tattoo by, of course it's by L'Oreal. Of course it's by L'Oreal. So I have like, I don't even know how many of these. I don't know if you guys can see that, but they are, it's Color Last. They last 24 hours. It's Color Tattoo. It's actually by Maybelline. I'm so sorry. Yeah, by Maybelline. Wow, I'm so sorry, wrong product I saw. I have a L'Oreal one here that I love too, but this is the 24 hour tattoo one. You put it on, literally, it's like I need a makeup remover to get it off. So they work really, really, really well. And I have them in lots of colors and they really just work really well. So I would highly recommend these. And I got them in like a gold, like a rose gold and then like a, like a white you know and I use this kind of as like in between you know like in between my eyes here and like up underneath my eyebrow and it's a really good highlighter so these are just I can't even talk enough about them um, and then again for the green one I get the infallible by L'Oreal these are really like you dip your brush in and you get a lot of pigment I'm telling you girl it is a lot of pigment so I would highly recommend this one as well um, I already talked about a couple of these, but uh, my face primer, I forgot to talk about that, but I always stay true to Rimmel for their Stay Matte. Definitely best stuff ever. And even if you, you know, don't have um, oily skin, I still think it's a really good primer. You know, it goes, gets in your skin and it stays, and your makeup stays well. So I would, I would recommend that. Powder, I would recommend the L'Oreal Hydra Perfect. It's close to the L'Oreal Mercier. It's the closest I've found. Um, you know, I put a little in the, you know, in the lid and I dab my, you know, and I bake with my um, good old beauty blender. You can get one of these that's store bought, but I'm gonna be honest, you're not gonna get the same quality. 
yet. I'm sure that they're gonna come out with some really cool ones and I'm waiting for that day. I really am. Um, but this is a really, really good one. L'Oreal Hydro Perfect. And I always get it in the lightest shade because, again, I'm not the tannest person in the world. Okay, last but not least, lips. What do I love? I'm gonna go back to NYX. They just, they nailed it. Their liquid suede balm, the balm. And I even got it in this blue color because I really am kind of into blue lips. I wouldn't wear that to work. It's not really L'Oreal, I won't wear it to work. Um, then the other one that I like by NYX is lingerie, NYX lingerie. Same thing, just a little bit different formula. It's a little bit more satiny, but it's still a matte. And it is, I, I love the color. I love this color. And this color is um, 07. So if you're into nudes like I am. Yeah, and then I have another one in a little bit darker color. I have it worn, it's brand new. I'm pretty excited to wear it. So the last thing that I'm gonna talk about and you know, I kind of have like a theme going on here, but e.l.f. This is my setting spray. Store-bought. Awesome. It really does work. I mean, it really does, you know, set it. It feels good on my skin. You know, even setting spray you can use like to kind of mist your face if you're dry that, you know, you come back from wherever. For some people you come out of, you know, into work and you're fine and then you come home and you're all dry and you need to go out. Spray some of this on. That'll make you all nice and glowy. Just glow like a little star. So, that's it. That's my store-bought drugstore favorites. Love them. Love them. So, I hope that everybody enjoyed this. And uh, Lori was Lori and Anna, you're my first requested video. Shout out to you. And shout out to everybody else. Please subscribe and leave me comments below. I really, really appreciate it. Really, really, really. So um, have a great the rest of your day. And I love all of you and you're all beautiful. Okay, bye.